The Quran, the central religious text of Islam, addresses various aspects of human behavior, including matters related to sexuality and sexual conduct. Regarding same-sex sexual activity, the Quran explicitly prohibits it and considers it as a sinful behavior. There are several verses in the Quran that are commonly interpreted as condemning homosexual acts. One such verse is found in Surah Al-Araf, 7,80-81, which references the story of the people of Lot, also known as the people of Sodom and Gomorrah, who engaged in same-sex sexual activity. The Quran portrays their actions as immoral and warns against such behavior. In addition to the Quran, interpretations and understandings of same-sex relationships and homosexuality within Islam can vary among scholars, communities, and individuals. Some scholars and Muslim communities take a more conservative stance, viewing same-sex sexual activity as a sin and incompatible with Islamic teachings. Others advocate for a more inclusive and compassionate approach, emphasizing the importance of respect, understanding, and support for LGBTQ plus individuals while differing on the permissibility of same-sex sexual relationships. It's worth noting that Islamic teachings emphasize the importance of mercy, compassion, and non-judgmental attitudes toward individuals with differing sexual orientations. Muslims are encouraged to approach matters of human sexuality with sensitivity and understanding, while upholding the teachings and principles of the Quran.